Hey there fellow millennials and zoomers, are you ready to adult like a boss and buy your first home in Australia? Well, before you go in and make the biggest purchase of your life, you need to do your research like a pro. Lucky for you, I've got some practical tips to help you out. So grab a cup of coffee, hit that subscribe button and let's get started. Here are the five things you need to do when researching your first property and of course, don't forget to hit that bell notification button. Let's go. So in preparing to buy your first home in Australia, it's to research your first property to buy to live in. Here are some practical tips for first home buyers to consider when researching the first property. Number one, determine your budget. Before you start researching properties, it's important to determine how much you can afford to spend. Use a mortgage calculator or use a mortgage broker to estimate the loan repayments based on your deposit amount, loan amount and interest rate. This will give you a realistic idea of what you can afford. And number two, consider your needs. Think about your lifestyle. What do you need in a home? Do you need a certain number of bedrooms or bathrooms? Do you need a backyard or a garage? Consider the location of the property and its proximity to things like public transport or schools or shopping centers in the West Bay. And number three, research the market. Research the property market in the area you are interested in. Look at recent sale prices for similar properties in the area to get an idea of what to expect. Use online property portfolios like real estate .com.au or domain.com.au to search for properties and filter your results by price range, location and other features. Or otherwise, use a mortgage broker which I have access to RP Data which is a paid premium service which I can give free reports to my clients. And number four, do your due diligence. Once you find a property you're interested in, do your due diligence. This means conducting a thorough inspection of the property and checking for any potential issues or defects. This means you actually got to go into the open inspection and look with your eyes and not look at your phone. Also get a building and pest inspection report to identify any structural or pest related problems with the property. Mm. And finally, number five, get legal advice. Before you sign any contract or sale, it's a good idea to get legal advice from a solicitor or conveyancer. They can help you understand the terms of the contract and ensure that everything is in order. Now you made it thus far in this video, I'm gonna give you some bonus tips. So when researching your first property, there are several pitfalls to look out for. Here are some rookie mistakes made by first home buyers who rush the process. Number one, failing to get a building and pest inspection. Some first home buyers may skip the building and pest inspection to save time and money. This can be a costly mistake if the property has major structural or pest related issues that you may not have noticed during your inspection. Number two, not researching the area. It's important to research the area that you're considering to buy, guys. Some first home buyers may rush into a purchase without considering the location's proximity to public transport, schools, and shopping centers. Remember, Westfield, Westfield, Westfields. And finally, bonus tip number three, being over eager in the bidding process, especially auctions. Some first home buyers may become over eager in the bidding process and may pay more than the property is worth. It's important to stay within your budget and not get caught up in the excitement of the auction. I mean, there have been several news articles in the past of first home buyers who didn't do their due diligence and encounter problems with their property purchase. For example, a case in 2020, a first home buyer in Sydney purchased a property without getting a building and pest inspection. And then later discovered major structural issues with the property and this cost the buyer thousands of dollars in repairs and could have been avoided with a thorough inspection. In summary guys, researching your first property is an important step in preparing to buy your first home in Australia by determining your budget, considering your needs, researching the market, doing your due diligence and finally getting legal advice you can increase your chances of finding the right property for you. And like I just mentioned before, just remember to avoid common rookie mistakes and don't rush into the purchase without doing your own research. And one thing that you shouldn't forget is to hit that subscribe button if you haven't. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Remember, I produce weekly videos like this, so don't miss out on hitting that subscribe button and that bell notification for more videos like this. Until next time, keep calm and mortgage on.